Red Sox hosting the Indians. Rain delayed the start of this one for 44 minutes, but they would eventually get started in Boston. John Lackey looking good early in the first. He strikes out Michael Bourne. And then he fans as Drupal Cabrera to end the inning. In the second, he gets some help from his defense. Jason Giambi with a grounder up the middle. Dustin Pedroia, the diving stop and the glove flip to Steven Drew. They turn the 4-6-3 double play to end the inning. Bottom of the second, two on and one out. Mike Carp steps in against Justin Masterson. In the air to right field, Stubbs looking up as that ball is going to go. Three-run home run for Mike Carp. His third home run in a Red Sox uniform, and the Red Sox take a 3-0 lead. That homer snaps an 0-for-21 slump for Carp, and Lackey continued to be outstanding on Friday night. He strikes out Mark Reynolds swinging in the fifth, and then he gets Drew Stubbs swinging to end the inning. In the sixth, he gets Nick Swisher swinging, and Lackey goes seven innings, one run on two hits with eight strikeouts. Red Sox up 4-1 in the seventh. Bases loaded with one out. Jacoby Ellsbury up against Rich Hill. Ellsbury grounds one by the dive. And Swisher to right field from third base comes Salta Lamacchia. Coming around from second to be Johnny Gomes. And the Red Sox take a 6-1 lead. Boston looking for more later in the inning. Two on and two out. Dustin Pedroia comes through with a two-run single. That scores Jose Iglesias and Jacoby Ellsbury. That made it 8-1 Red Sox. And Boston would go on to win by that score. John Lackey improves to three and four. Justin Masterson falls to seven and three. Eight of the nine Red Sox starters picked up hits in this one. And prior to the game, Will Middlebrooks was placed on the 15-day DL with a lower back strain, as well as Shane Victorino, who is suffering from tightness in his left hamstring.